One of the Islamist groups fighting in northern Mali has split and now wants dialogue. The Islamic movement for Azawad said in a statement that it was splitting from Ansar Ding and was ready for peace talks. Meanwhile, a contingent of 160 soldiers from Burkina Faso has been deployed to Makala in central Mali. They're the first West African troops to link up with French and Malian forces moving against the rebels occupying the north. Carol Oyula reports. The newly formed Islamic movement for Azawad is a breakaway faction of the Islamist rebel group Ansar Din. In a statement on Thursday, the new group said it rejected all forms of extremism and terrorism. The group also said it wanted a peaceful solution to the Mali crisis. The statement said the new group was composed entirely of Malian nationals. It called on Malian authorities and France to cease hostilities in the zones they were occupying to create a climate of peace which will pave the way for political dialogue. This comes as the first contingent of an African force being deployed in Mali began moving towards the center of the country. French Foreign Minister Laurent Fabios said on Wednesday that a total of 1,000 troops from West African countries had been deployed in the capital, Bamako. These are in addition to around 500 soldiers from Chad who have been based in Niger. Benin, Niger, Nigeria and Togo all already have troops in Bamako. Meanwhile, the head of the European Union's training mission in Mali said it is a long-term project meant to help the country rebuild its own army. The Malian army needs equipment because it has lost some of the equipment it had and it's not a rich country. The army also needs technical training for its men and it especially needs to rebuild the trust that will give it the necessary morale to go and fight. The United Nations has warned against the risk of inter-ethnic violence and genocide in Mali following reports of abuses and executions allegedly carried out by the Malian army. Officials say they require full access on the ground. The fact that there are rumors does not mean that these rumors are true. So it is important to be there to verify them. So for us, access is one of the most important aspects and we're trying to see how we can maximize this access throughout the country, not only on the humanitarian side, but also for protection. International donors are due to meet in the Ethiopian capital, Addis Ababa, on 29th January to discuss the African military operation in Mali. France says they would be asked to provide about $452 million. Carol Oyola, CCTV.